So you want to play Minecraft Bedrock Edition on PC, and here's the thing. Everyone who's purchased Java Edition has access to Minecraft Bedrock Edition, and I'm going to quickly show you, if you have Java Edition, how to access that. Now, if you don't have Java Edition, I'm going to show you how to play this with Game Pass. I'm going to show you how to download it separate. There's so much that's going to be covered in this video, but just for everyone who's here who has Java Edition already, which is a lot of people, just go into the Minecraft launcher here, and then on the left-hand side, you'll see Minecraft for Windows. This is Bedrock Edition. Click play, and boom, you are now playing Minecraft Bedrock Edition because everyone who has Java Edition has Bedrock Edition. So I just wanted to make sure that everyone knew that and that that is how if you have Java, you can easily switch over to Bedrock and boom, you're now in game and good to go. Now, what if you don't have Minecraft already? Well, you'll need to purchase Minecraft. And in the description down below, we have a link to here, which is where you can go to purchase Minecraft. This is the official Minecraft website. And when you go ahead and click Get Minecraft here, it will walk you through the process of getting Minecraft. Now, as you can see, there's the Deluxe Edition. You don't need this, because this is giving you a bunch of other stuff like mine coins and everything. Truly, all you need is Minecraft down here. This gives you access to Minecraft Java and Bedrock Edition, as well as that Minecraft launcher we were just using. Go ahead and go to checkout, and then just check out like you would any other game you're gonna be logging in with a microsoft account and all of that stuff now once you've purchased minecraft and done this with your microsoft account what you'll want to do is go ahead and download the minecraft launcher well that's in the description down below as well let me uninstall the launcher just to show you what this process will look like and while that is being done i have a message from our company simple game hosting once you get minecraft you're probably gonna want to play with friends and one of the best ways to do that is using a minecraft server and luckily at the first link in the description down below the breakdown.xyz slash sgh you can start your very own minecraft server on Bedrock Edition or Java Edition. You can even set up a Java Edition server and allow Bedrock players to join it using something called Geyser. It's really, really cool, and it's all supported at Simple Game Hosting. You can easily add add-ons to your server, and if you're on Java Edition, mods, plugins, mod packs, and all of that are fully supported as well. Sadly, all that stuff's not on Bedrock Edition, or we would support it. Truthfully, anything you want to do with your Minecraft server, you can do it as long as Minecraft allows it at Simple Game Hosting. And on top of that, we got live chat support and a high-quality help center to help you out. So go check out Simple Game Hosting at the first link in the description down below the breakdown.xyz slash sgh to start your very own minecraft server on bedrock or java edition the simple way now that that's deleted how do we go ahead and get the minecraft launcher well we do have a link in the description down below and this is the minecraft launcher here and there's basically two ways to get it you could go through this link if you go ahead and choose the minecraft launcher here in this choose edition and then click get, it's going to take you through the process of logging in with Xbox. Now, if we go ahead and log in, it will go ahead, it will take us back to here, right? Yeah, we kind of just did a big circle there, but that's okay. Because now, instead of having all those buttons, we can just install two, and then we want to go ahead and launch the Minecraft launcher and click open Xbox. Now, if you don't have the Xbox app here, this won't work. You'll need to download it a different way, but as you can see, we can now go ahead and click install in the Xbox app and do all of that stuff. But I'm not going to install it this way, because that's one way to install it, and if you have Game Pass, that's how you'll have to install it. But you can also get the Minecraft launcher via the Microsoft Store, which is my preferred method. So go to the Microsoft Store here, and then once you're in the Microsoft Store, the process is similar. At the top, what we want to do is search for Minecraft Launcher, and then we want to find the Minecraft Launcher right up here at the top. And then when you click on it, it should say Microsoft Studios is who develops it, just to confirm things, and this is the correct one. And then you want to go ahead and click Install here. Now, it's free to install the launcher even if you've not purchased Minecraft but this is my preferred way of installing it then go ahead and click play and it's going to go ahead and open up the minecraft launcher right like so now you can like i said use the xbox app there's absolutely nothing wrong with using the xbox app and it's how you're going to get minecraft if you're playing it with game pass but if you're not playing it with game pass you will want to go ahead and use the microsoft store because i just like to use the microsoft store you can use xbox it's kind of up to you now once you're here what you're going to want to do is log in so as you can see you have this login option you'll log in with microsoft and you'll be good to go and by the way if you have game pass this can actually calculate it so keep that in mind as well if we go ahead and click let's go there it will now log us into that account i just logged out of and guess what you can play minecraft using that left-hand sidebar, Minecraft for Windows, or Java Edition. By the way, there's a lot of perks to Java Edition. I would recommend Java Edition wholeheartedly. But let's go ahead and go back to Minecraft for Windows here. Click play, and now Minecraft Bedrock Edition is opening up. So there you have it. That is how you can play Minecraft Bedrock Edition on PC. How to download it, how to set it up, how to do everything. It's super in-depth. And then from there, you can go ahead and click play and join servers. You can join worlds. Anything you want, you're good to go. So anyway, if you got any questions, let us know in the comment section down below. Be sure to give you a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel for more incredible content. We'll see you in the next one. Peace.